Android tablet market is drying up, Samsung's new Galaxy Tab S6 aims to make a difference. It's a premium tablet with top of the line specifications and some really impressive features. So if you own a Galaxy Tab S6, let me tell you that you have made a great choice. But now, if you want to make the most out of this new device, there are a couple of tips and tricks that you must know. Hi guys, this is Ashi from Guiding Tech and let's take a look, shall we? The Galaxy Tab S6 runs Samsung's One UI based on Android 9 Pie and as such it includes all the features offered in One UI on other Samsung devices. Since we have already covered One UI tips and tricks in the previous videos, let me get straight to the other tips and tricks. But just in case you want to have a look at that video of the One UI tips and tricks, the link will be in the description below. So once you're done with this one, do make sure that you check that one too. Now, most of these tips and tricks are centered around the S Pen that comes with the Tab S6. So you can keep it ready and try them out along with me as you watch the video. So first, we'll take a look at the S Pen shortcuts. Now, whenever you pull out the S Pen from its charging position on the back of the Tab, you'll notice an S Pen icon on one side of the screen. Tapping on the icon opens up the S Pen shortcuts that you can use quickly to take notes, capture screenshots or use other S Pen features. But did you know that you can customize these shortcuts? Well, now you do. In order to customize the S Pen shortcuts, tap on the icon and then in the following menu, tap on the shortcuts option and then choose the shortcuts you want. You can even add your most used apps in the shortcut menu if you want to launch them quickly. Isn't that cool? Now that you've got a shortcut in place, let's take a look at the Smart Selective feature. This is a really cool way to capture screenshots of only the essential parts of the screen using the S Pen. To use the feature, tap on the S Pen icon and then select Smart Select. Here tap and drag the S Pen around the area you want to select and Tab will automatically take a screenshot of the selection. Once you have taken a screenshot, you'll be able to extract text from it by tapping on the option or you can pin the image to the home screen by tapping on the option that you see right there. You can even edit the screenshot from the same screen. Just tap on the edit button from the bottom toolbar and annotate the screenshot with the S Pen. Simple right? Now I'm sure that you already know that you can take notes on your Tab S6 but did you know that you can even take notes when the screen is off? To do so, pull out the S Pen, press the button and then double tap on the screen with it. The screen should immediately light up and you'll now be able to take notes on the locked screen. Once you're done taking notes, just tap on the save button on the top right corner and the notes will automatically be saved in the Samsung Notes app. This feature can really come in handy when you want to take notes in hurry and just don't want to unlock the screen, give that pattern, wait for the face and lock. Next up, let's jump into the camera app and you must try out some cool things that you can do with the S Pen here. You can tap the button of the S Pen once to take a photo or tap it twice to switch to the front camera. You can press the button and swipe horizontally to circle between the different modes of the camera app. And if you want to zoom in, you can press the button and then rotate the pen in circular motion. Pretty cool, right? It's like holding a Harry Potter magic wand. Now all of these S Pen features are cool and all, but did you know that you can even unlock your tab with the S Pen? But in order to do so, you'll first need to enable the feature. For that, let's quickly jump into the settings and here head over to the advanced features. Once you're there, tap on S Pen and then select the S Pen unlock option. And in the following menu, tap on the toggle next to the unlock with S Pen remote feature and you're good to go. Now whenever you want to unlock your tab, just tap on the button on the S Pen and the tab will unlock. This feature will even work when the screen is turned off. Pretty cool, right? Moving on, let's take a look at two cool One UI features that you probably haven't used till now. The first will allow you to hide apps in the app drawer, which will come in real handy if you don't want people snooping in through your personal apps. To hide an app in One UI, long press on the home screen and tap on home screen settings. In the following menu then, select hide apps from launcher settings and then select the apps you wish to hide. These apps you select won't show up in the app drop and nobody will be able to access them without your permission. Pretty handy, won't you say? And now to round things off, let's put 
some apps to sleep. Yes, you heard me right. One UI has a feature that lets you put apps to sleep so that they don't run in the background. This feature can be used on apps that you don't use all the time, I mean that are not so frequent and it can really help you to save some precious battery life. To do so, head over to the settings and search for always sleeping apps. Select the sleeping apps option and then following menu, select the apps you would want to put to sleep. Once you have chosen these apps, you're all set. These particular apps won't run in the background and save some amount of the device's battery life. But it's worth noticing that the apps you add in the list might not be able to receive updates or send notifications. So make sure that you don't include any essential app or you might miss important updates in the future. And well, that sums it up for this video. Make sure you drop a like if you like the video and don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. So guys, this is Ashish signing off and I hope to see you in the next video. Till then, take care and have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.